So should you actually use realloc instead of just uh, malloc mem copy and free? Because in some situations, you could uh, avoid copying the original memory twice because uh, there are cases in which you wouldn't actually want the original memory. Say I want to add another character in front of the whole string. So uh, if I use malloc mem copy and free, I can just add the or you know malloc and then add the uh, character and then just mem copy to the right offset. But if I use uh, realloc. I'll need to copy the original memory. That is, if the realloc is just a simple mem copy malloc free. But um, I guess it depends on the implementation. But for glibc, uh, it will try to grow the memory. Uh, we can see it will call where is it? Int realloc. Then if we look at int realloc, it will try to expand forward to the next chunk and stuff but if it is a large allocation if it's uh, memory mapped it will use mremap on Linux or uh, if mremap is available but otherwise it will uh, do a malloc mem copy and free so on I guess BSD or something where Emory map is not available. Well, I don't know if BSD doesn't. So uh, yeah, before you, you know, stop using realloc because you don't need the original memory. You probably still want to use it, um, unless I guess you know that it's not worth it to do a realloc because you don't need the original memory. But uh, yeah, it's not not the simple malloc mem copy and free it's 